Hi there, I'm Dana Jacobson alongside Mr. X Games himself, Sal Masakela, at the Home Depot Center site of X Games 15. Hard to believe, four days in the books and done. It's a wrap. <laughs> but before we wrap it up, we want to count down the top ten moments for you. Let's do it. Let's count them down, starting at number ten. And we go to the Aussie, Blake Williams winning Moto X Freestyle. Well, Bilko, a lot of people felt, uh, had been ripped off. Uh, in best trick, but uh, this guy's 360 combinations, he does that trick like other people just do a straight air. It was about time for him. I told him he makes it look so easy yeah. out there. Number nine, Travis Pastrana trying the cork 720. Uh, yeah, this is a top moment because he lived, yeah. Dana. It, it really, really is, and uh, needless to say, he was hurt. Guys, thank you for the support. My bum hurts. <laughs> a lot of bums hurt that night. <laughs> Scotty Cranmer wins BMX Park at number eight. Scotty Cranmer came into this park and he he rode at a level that no one could even comprehend. Transfer after transfer. Daniel Dares, uh, he's going to have to step his park game up. And how about P-Rod at number seven winning Skate Street? You know, with about 30 seconds to go, all P-Rod had to do was an ollie down those stairs, but he opted for the switch heel flip, getting the win. That's why your gold medalist, PLG, also winning gold to Skate Vert. Uh, great battle with him and Bucky. Uh, but PLG just stomping it. Bucky with the, with the, the McEgg there, but not enough. PLG able to defend his gold. Danny Way at number five, Big Air Rail Jam. Uh, we're going to change his name to Pain. <laughs> Pain Way. Uh, oh. This was an event he wanted. He had a bum knee, bum ankle, as you know. Switch 50-50. He had to roll in switch because his ankle was in too much pain to roll in regular. He's unreal. And let's talk about the progression of the X Games at number four. Indeed, there's no ceiling at the X Games. Simon DeBron stomping those 900s. And, of course, Anthony Napolitan with this double front flip that he learned on an air mat in Pennsylvania. Number three, the three peaks. Yeah, big three peaks. Uh, Jamie Bestwick rides at a level that he just, his peers, they're not really his peers. <laughs> and uh, Kyle Loza, I didn't think he'd be able to do it. I sure as hell didn't think he was going to do it, breaking out the same trick from last year. Uh, we're just happy that he made it. And number two, Ashley Filick winning Women's Super X. Uh, to call it the feel-good story of X Games would be an understatement. The, the most inspiring athlete here. And just great, solid racing, you know, biding her time, stalking Jen, and getting the win. Yeah, profoundly deaf, but I keep saying she's the one silencing her competition. Yeah, she hears more than all of us. Yeah, Jake Brown at number one in Skateboard Big Air. Well, from 2007, you know, Jake Brown was the most famous guy for a slam not to win. He changed that with his Ollie 360 into a 20 foot 540, spoiling Bob Burnquist three Pete. That's 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 good competition. That's going to do it for us here in LA. I'm Dana Jacobson for Sal Masakela. Don't forget to check out the Action Sports Report on ESPN News and always online ESPN.com/slash action.